sure to get your play mat today at tsx1.com. So, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Sam from Team Sam X1 here. Happy Wednesday! Whoa! Hopefully you guys are enjoying your Wednesday because in today's video, I probably have the craziest opening of all time when it comes to opening yo-yo packs on my channel. You guys already know I love to open packs. You guys already know I love to open up expensive things. But today is literally the pinnacle of my career. All I ask you guys to do is literally, please, smash Oh, that thumbs up button for more awesome Yu-Gi-Oh videos, man. Because without your support, I would never be able to, to literally buy this Yu-Gi-Oh pack. So you guys better smash the let me heck out of that thumbs up button. Also, this week is Christmas week, so happy Christmas, guys, please. Happy Christmas. Hopefully you guys are enjoying your wonderful holidays. All right, guys, enough talking. Without further ado, let's just go straight to Dolly's. All right, guys, so right here, is strictly sealed. One of the most renowned collectors that I know here in Toronto. And yo, SS, <laughs> what do you got for us today? Show us. No, like the, the packs. Yeah, yeah. The packs. so I got uh, first edition, uh, here, Legend on. of Blue Eyes, White Dragon. These are guaranteed unweighed. Uh, actually, like these are glossy packs. So if anybody knows like about Yu-Gi-Oh, glossy packs can't be weighed. Um, but I know that these have not been searched because the guy who had the box, he actually actually offered me to purchase the box. But uh, at the time, I, I was sh short on funds. So he decided to just break open the box. And then he sold. Uh, he was actually offering me the 24 packs like for, for cheaper after nobody was buying. But uh, somebody picked up four of them. And then somebody else picked up eight. And I just came and picked up the rest. All right, bro. So can you like explain to us like What's the best card in here? Like, come on. Like, All right, so uh, obviously like the LOB Blue Eyes first edition is the best card you can pull in here. But uh, this this set, in my opinion, if you're not looking for the Blue Eyes, I think that glossy Gaia the Dragon Champion packs are the best because Gaia the Dragon Champion is the lowest population uh, LOB holo mm -hmm. and in PSA 10. And it's like practically like non-existent. Like even if you go on eBay and you're trying to find a raw copy, like it's very hard to come by and Whoa. get some, like uh, like a nice, uh, you know, near mint copy of Guy the Dragon Champion. So in my opinion, I think these are like the best packs to open because they give you the highest chance of pulling like good good stuff. Okay, awesome. So first edition, like how rare are these packs basically? The, the packs are, I mean, Gaia, Gaia packs like rarely come up for sale. Like What's I mean, a Gaia pack? Can you, so, can you explain? so the way you can tell that this is a Gaia pack is you can tell here, uh, you can see that the code is 53-X. Mm -hmm. So if I was going to bring you an LOB box, wow. first edition, you could see on the code here, it's 48-3. So this is a Trihorn Dragon box. Basically, hobby and retail, the difference is six digits. So you add six digits onto this and you get this number right here. And that's how you know that this is a... A Gaia it's pack. A Gaia pack, exactly. Yeah. So it is a tri Sorry, you pack? Add, you add two, uh, six dishes to this number right here. Wow. How much is this? does this box go for right now retail? How much does it cost? So you'll see a lot of listings. So a wavy box, uh, I would say is around uh, 35, like 25 to $35,000. What's even crazier is that right now the box is being listed on eBay for an upwards of 45 to $50,000. So price range between that and like 35, to 50k for an lob first edition booster box yo that's crazy yeah and the glossy box is around uh, 20, 20 to twenty five thousand dollars. so so like glossy is not worth more like it's worth less like why like how come so right now uh in my opinion a, a lot of collectors they really uh chase the wavy cards because they think that they came first but actually glossy cards came first mm -hmm. people don't know that yet and not enough people know that yet, I guess. And because of this, uh, a lot more people chase the wavy cards, which is why this one has a premium. But in my opinion, in the long term, as things get more and more expensive and investors come into the market, high end collectors come into the market, uh, I think the gap between the two is going to close. Mm -hmm. And in my opinion, if you have the money, it's better to go pick up like two boxes uh, or three boxes of glossy instead of two boxes of wavy in my opinion you don't know what cards have been pulled out of these right like out of the 24 no. packs so we don't even know i asked the guy to ask the people who purchased from them they didn't decide they didn't open anything yet so 
nobody really knows like what's in them. And Ruxin has a, uh, Ruxin purchased three packs from here. You guys know Ruxin. Yeah, I he know got, Ruxin. He got slapped by uh, Sam when they did the pack oh, so, battle. Oh, so I won with that ill blood. Yeah, yeah, that ill blood is like game changer. Like, okay, all right, okay, awesome. So I won that. You guys, you guys, in my opinion, you okay, won. in his opinion, this guy's a well renowned collector here, bro. So I won that battle, amazing. All right, guys, it is time. All right, guys, so in front of you is the nine legendary LOB first edition packs. You guys see, look at this. This is the obviously the old logo, yeah, old, old logo right here, the first edition stamp. Uh, which is absolutely crazy. And we're gonna pick one of these packs right here. If you hit a blue eyes white dragon, how much is that? Like ungraded? Ungraded if, if, mint? I mean, like out of this ten thousand like, dollars? I'll pay ten thousand US for wow. One, like for literally, 10. if if I pull one right now, you you, you give me ten k. I'll, I'll I'll give you ten k right now. Yeah, for it. <laughs> <laughs> Lawrence, I need you here, bro. And guys, look at this. This is literally the holy grail of the Yu-Gi-Oh packs right here. This is actually ridiculous, man. I've never seen this thing ever in my life. This is literally the pinnacle of my career right now <laughs> to see one of these things. The funny thing is, yo, like I told you before, if you guys watched my dance video when I was in Alberta, remember Grandpa Milano? This is my main first edition collection. Listen to me, old man. I'll trade you all of these. He offered me to buy a booster box <laughs> at that time in August for $12,000 Canadian. Canadian? Wow. 12K Canadian, bro. He said 12K, I'll go home and I'll bring it right now. Blue Eyed Dragon First Edition Stops. boxes. How much is that? $12,000. May I see? I don't keep it here in the store, but we do have it. You can have it in 15 minutes. All right, Lawrence, this is the time, bro. Remember, these packs has not been on, has not been searched. We have nine packs, one another nine, bro. We have to pick one pack. I can only get one pack. And we're gonna go home, we're gonna open it with a bunch of other packs. Lawrence, which one are you picking? Which one, bro? <laughs> Come on, bro. You're picking for me, bro. This one? This, this one? Ah! All right, guys. So, Lauren says the blue eyes in here. I guarantee you. Omar, thank you so much. Strictly Absolutely. SS, bro. This is all. This is it, bro. I'm going to give these back to you. Here you go, sir. Thank you so here much. Here you man. go. Appreciate all right, guys. It. Listen. Listen, Lawrence. We have to get the blue eyes. All right, guys. I just got back from Dolly's and shout out to Strictly Sealed, man. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little informative aspect of this video. Each time I make new videos like these, I want you guys to have, you know, a glimpse and a history on what it's like to know about these Yu-Gi-Oh packs and things like that. And it's really cool to know the history of Yu-Gi-Oh, man. It's super duper awesome. You know, since I'm a huge lover of Yu-Gi-Oh for quite some time now, it's super awesome to be able to get a chance to do something like this. And it's not every day that a thing like this comes up. And like you guys saw, this is the pack that Lawrence picked for me for the opening. This is the first edition Legends of Blue Eyes booster pack, costing me around $1,500 Canadian for this pack right here. I'm literally risking it all for a Blue Eyes White Dragon. This pack cost me $1,500 Canadian dollars right here. I cannot wait. Wow, I cannot wait to actually even open this on the channel. We're gonna open this at the very end to see on what we can potentially get out of these packs. We also got some awesome Yu-Gi-Oh packs to open on the channel as well. In today's pack opening, I got you guys two first edition Ancient Prophecy pack. If you guys do not know, first edition Ancient Prophecy is probably one of the hardest packs to obtain in this entire world. Then the reason being is because they did not make any booster boxes when it comes to this, okay? They made booster boxes, but the unlimited version of the booster boxes, the only way you can obtain first edition Ancient Prophecy is in a tin. And I believe there's only like one pack per tin that you can get Ancient Prophecy first edition in. So this pack is extremely, extremely rare. So we got two Ancient Prophecies. We got, of course, two Magic Rulers, okay? With the old logo, old square logo. This is the OG 2002. All right, we got uh, Legacy of Darkness. We got two Labyrinth of Nightmare. And last but not least, we got two Feral Servants. So these are amazing packs that I cannot wait to just straightly dive into before I open up the Legends of Blue Eyes White Dragon. So guys, I'm, I'm shaking, man. I don't even know what to do. I don't even know what to say. First and foremost, let's just get started with the Ancient Prophecy first and then we'll move on to the Blue Eyes White Dragon. So guys, before we get started, it's Christmas week. Happy Christmas. Hopefully you guys are enjoying your holidays. I released this brand new playmat this week. The brand new Legends Unite Limited Edition Christmas playmat. If you guys love Dark Magician Girl, Tamias, and you know, our little boy Jack Frost right here. You guys all know I always drop limited edition Christmas mats and this is by far one of my most beautiful and favorites playmats when it comes to 
Christmas edition. Guys, happy holiday. Hopefully you guys are enjoying your holiday. Make sure you guys tell your mom, tell your dad, tell your brother, sister, boyfriend, girlfriend that you love them. Uh, because you know this year has been one heck of a year. And the fact that we're able to come together during this season and just enjoy Christmas, enjoy this gift giving uh, season. Hopefully you guys are just enjoying that even though our year has been super crazy with the Crush Card virus. But anyways, yes! Make sure you guys get this beautiful Christmas edition playmat today in the link down below. And yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I love you guys. And without further ado, let's get started with the two Ancient Prophecy packs right now. All right, here we go, baby. If you get a ghost rare out of this, I'll be super happy. All right, so how should we go about opening these packs? I don't want to damage the packs because these packs are super duper old, old school. And I know some people that collect packs, so... I don't know, but damn, these packs are old. First thing that I want to do is I just want to smell them. <sighs> damn, god damn. Brain Research Lab, nice. Ooh, wow. These are like super, like they're slippery, man. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's my oil hands, but these packs are slippery. Maybe, maybe they're European print. Maybe if I'm not mistaken, European print. Ooh, Graf, Gap, Divine Soldier. First edition. Ooh, Jester Confi. Nice. Super rare first edition. That looks absolutely phenomenal. But yeah, these packs look so good. These cards look so good. Silver Wing, Divine Dragon, Aqua Bazaar, Sword of Sparkles, X Savers, Scary Moth. All right, here we have it. That was pretty much it for the first first edition Ancient Prophecy pack. We got a super rare. Wow, this is very nice. I'm gonna sleeve all my cards that I get, that's good. So yes, go on to the next pack of Ancient Prophecy. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, Cyborg Doctor. Oh, these packs smell amazing. Honestly, some people roast me in the comments for smelling the cards, but I don't know what it is, man. It's like, you you were, like, you know, you were born with five senses, right? To see, to touch, to smell. Um, I don't know the other two, but maybe I'm, I'm wrong. But you're born to smell things, man. If you open the Yu-Gi-Oh pack and you don't smell the cards, at least, okay, you, you don't have to go like crazy and, and smell them like that. Like you just sniff it and just enjoy the smell. If you can do that, it's like, I don't, I, I, I don't know what's wrong with you, bro. Like, well, you're weird. You don't smell packs. But Quirky Mero Hydro Barrier, Flambo Counter, Iron Core Luster, and next pack, Flame Wolf Fire Dog First Edition. Can, can we get a hollow? Core Blaster, no hollow for this one, just a rare, but that's all good, man. You got one hollow, which is just for Confi, uh, which is absolutely amazing. Is it Confit or Confi? I'm pretty sure it's Confi, if I'm not mistaken, but there we go. Super rare just for Confi. Amazing, this card's used in a lot of Pendulum decks. So you can special this card from your hand in face of attack position. If you do, return this card from one face of monster pointing towards the hand during the end phase of your opponent's next turn. So it's a free spellcaster extender, which is absolutely phenomenal. So Jester Confi, put that there. Let's get started with Pharaoh Servant next. Pharaoh Servant, this pack, you can get Jinzo out of there, which is absolutely incredible. All right, now we're on to the older school stuff, uh, which is amazing. Unfortunately, these aren't first editions, but we do have a first edition LOB pack that's coming right up. Solomon's Law Book, ooh. Hayabusha Knight, Solemn Wishes, Wing Weaver, Armor Glass, and last but not least, Flame Champion. Wow, these packs smell really nice. Like the older the packs, the more smellier it gets. You know what I mean? It's like, like you dry aging steak, you know? If you dry aged steak for 40 plus days, the taste of the steak better and also smells, you know? Like, you know, it smells bad, but you know what I mean? Like it, it tastes better if the longer it marinates. Attack and receive, Island Turtle. Great defensive card. Prohibition, nice. This is the OG way. You can utilize Prohibition as a rare. And it also says magic card too, which is really legit. Respect play. For your respective turns, each player must show their opponents their hand. Nice, respect play. Gruachin, Kugawata. Soul of the Forgotten, and Gus. Try on our last and final pack for Pharaoh Servant. Let's get started with Labyrinth of Nightmare. You got two packs of LON right here. These are not first edition, so I apologize, but man, hopefully we get a hollow out of these packs, man. If we get a hollow, I'll be really happy. Empress Mantis, Spirit of Flames, Lightning Blade, Gorilla Wind Spirit, Ooh, Nuva the Wicked, Grand Tiki Elder, Cure Mermaid, Ibio Dr Dragmord, Ikibio Dragmord, and the Earl of Demise. All right, man. Well, like I said, it smells better. Now last pack. Of Labyrinth of Nightmare, man. We're almost at the Legends of Blue Eyes pack. Man, please, please, man, please. 
something good. Okay, we got Bait Dog, The Forgiven Maiden, Mask of Weakness, nice. St. John, Draugen of the Spiritualist, Lady Panther, nice. Uh, Grand Tiki Elder, Cure Mermaid, and Ikibio Dragmord, right here. Wow, so no hollows for the older school packs. Let's just start with the two Legacy of the Darkness. If we get a hollow, please, a hollow. Just one hollow, I'll be super happy. Honestly, it'll be more rewarding. We get no hollows of these packs, and we get like a blue eyes in uh, the LOB pack. The Dragon's head, Dragon's Bead, nice. Mm. Ready of the Interceptin, ready for intercepting. Nutrient Z, Warrior Digrapher, and the Dragon Dwelling in the Cave. All right, guys, last but not least, last pack of Legacy of Darkness. All right, guys, I'd like to apologize for not giving you guys the opportunity to smell these packs. There you go, take a quick whiff. There you go. Man, if YouTube comes with a way that you can smell stuff in videos, that'll be phenomenal. Wing Minion, Burst Breath, Frontier Wiseman. Ooh, Fatal Abacus, a nice. Conver Convulsion of Nature, Woodland Spirit, Dragon's Gunfire, and a Wing Beat of Giant Dragon. And all right, guys, that's pretty much it for Labyrinth Nightmare. We're on to the last pack, okay? We're on to two Magic Rulers, and we're going straight to the LOB first edition booster pack. This is it, guys. This is it. Ooh, I'm getting goosebumps. Just, uh, just literally just, I don't even want to open it, to be honest, bro. I don't even want to open it, man. Please. All right, Gravekeeper Servant. Okay, you guys all know there's amazing spell cards in the set. Like Graceful Charity, Giant Rat, nice. Turtle Oath, Twin Long Rod number two, Chorus of Sanctuary, and Mechanical Snail. There's a bunch of crazy spells in here. Snatch Deals in here. Giant Trunade is in here. A bunch of crazy stuff in match rulers right here so guys smell that oh my god here we have it boys okay we got gringo final destiny penguin knight igabon flying flying kamikari number one guardian of the throne room labyrinth wall liquid beast and house of adhesive tape whoa all right guys i don't even want to open this i'm getting goosebumps as we're literally making this video right now i am literally shaking right now. Let me see my camera is recording. Okay, my camera is recording. And bruh, we're on to the last and final. Legends of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Oh my God. Bruh, I don't even wanna open this, guys. I don't even wanna open this. This pack cost me $1,500 Canadian to open. And you guys see, this pack is super legit, super old school. The first Yu-Gi-Oh pack ever made. You guys heard Strictly Sealed explain to you guys how important this pack is and how rare this pack is. Oh my God, first edition booster pack. Ah, oh, damn it. All right, here we go, boys. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna be very careful with this. Really, really careful. How do I even open this pack? Oh my God. Oh, I don't wanna open this. Oh man. Oh, please. I'm sweating, guys. I'm actually sweating. I need to wet my hands. Ah! Oh my God! No! Please, how do I open this? Oh, I took a piece of foil off. Oh man! I actually want to keep and preserve this pack. Okay, we got it. Oh my God, guys! Ancient Egypt has just been unwrapped. The Pharaoh's tomb has been unleashed. Ancient Egypt has been unlocked, guys. Oh, uh, Kaiba is coming out of here. Yugi is coming out of here. And oh my god. Wow. Wow. $1,500. <sighs> Smell that right there, boys. Smell that, please. Smell that. All right, here we go. A hollow, please. Yeah. All right, here we go. First edition LB pack. Urabi. Two Mouth Dark Ruler, Hinotama, Armored Starfish. I know it's not worth $1,500, but goddamn, 
It's a hollow. <gasps> how do, I don't know how to, oh my God, this is literally minty fresh, bro. First edition. Guys, I am getting goosebumps 24 seven right now. <gasps> <laughs> wow, guys, I know it's on a blue eyes, but I'm super happy that we get a hollow, man. Wow, out of nine packs, we got a hollow. <laughs> Let's go! Kaibusha's blue flame, dark energy, and flame manipulator. That was so flipping awesome. <gasps> Yo! Celtic Guardian, first edition, LOB, pack fresh mint. Wow, holy moly. Guys, this was it. <gasps> we didn't get a blue eyes, that's okay. But we got Celtic Guardian. <laughs> oh my God, this is gorgeous, man. Holy moly. I'm happy, man, I'm happy. We could've got nothing, we could've just got a rare, but we got Celtic Guardian. Imagine that's a blue eyes, though. Imagine if that was a blue eyes. That would've been crazy, so. Honestly, I think an estimated value for this card in a PSA 9 is probably 300 to $400, uh, which is insane. Obviously, it doesn't make up for the pack, but the fact that we get a holo out of a first edition LLB pack is absolutely incredible. I love this, this is awesome, this was crazy. And man, I'm gonna start my collection journey very, very soon. So, man, this is beautiful. I don't know how much is this PSA 10. Uh, this is a PSA, oh, PSA 10 is $1,500, but PSA 9 is $400, uh, which is a huge price event, but damn, this is gorgeous. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Guys, help me my board packs, guys. Please get your play bats today. Click down below for more awesome Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, man. If you guys haven't gotten your Christmas edition, Legend Unite play mat, make sure you guys get it today in the link down below at TX1.com. You guys are absolutely phenomenal. This was extremely fun. Guys, stay tuned for this week's video. It's gonna be crazy for what's to come next, man. It's gonna be ridiculous. Thank you guys so much for watching. And yeah, man, it's gonna be crazy. This is your boy Sam from Team Mr. Sam signing out. Thank you guys again. I love you guys so much. And this has been a crazy, crazy Yu-Gi-Oh! opening. First edition, LOB. Legends of Blue Eyes White Dragon, and we packed the legendary legend himself, Celtic Guardian. Thank you guys so much for watching. Smash! Then let me hack that thumbs up button. It's your boy Sam from TV Channel Sam signing out. Wow, that's crazy. All right, guys. Peace. Yes! Sure to get your playmat today at tsx1.com.